Hi, this is Jan from Jan's Art. Um, I'm just starting a new project. Um, I want to draw this cat. Now I've traced the outline from the photo and I'm using the photo as a reference to draw it. Now what I've done is I've just started putting in some very basic flat outlines. So let's put an alpha lock on that. Let's go to my favourite brush and let's go with, what shall I use? I'll use a soft blend, see what happens with that. Opacity about 50%, so I'll come in and it's very little brush size. And I'm, what I'm concentrating on is just the ear. There we go. See? So I just want to get that. Now because I've got the alpha lock on, my strokes won't go beyond the... my base colours so there we go I've got the um, outline on top but I've made it so it's a bit faded out it's still there and I can see everything that's it let's have a go at this and see what we can do with this Right, I'm going to go with a, well, inside the ear, there we go, that's what I want to do, that's what I'm working with. Now inside the ear I have a, a grey, a dark grey, so let's put that dark grey in there, okay, oops, too much, let's just... That's it, we've got a nice little grey area in there. Okay. Now I have a, a black area, so I need to put that in first. Just going up along the edge of the highlight of the ear. Can you see it? Right. See where I'm putting the black. Okay. So I bring the black all the way halfway into the ear. Let's just raise it a bit. That's it. Okay, let's go back to my grey. Change the size. Oh, that grey is a little bit white. So I'm going to tone it down a little bit. Oh, that's a better grey. Okay, that's better. Right, I'm going to go back to this purple that I've got. Or violet. And I just want to Do a nice little fade into the grey area, you see. This is just the ear that I'm working on, so. Right, so I've got me fade in, see. I'm just using a soft blend. Okay, so it, it starts to look a little bit transparent, but that's okay. I'm just going to go in with some more black. Pressing a little bit stronger against the edge. That's it. I want to put some brown in into that grey. I'll just change the opacity. I'll just put a hint of this cherry brown in. Look. There we go. That's it. 
Now I've got that the way I want it. Right now, let's start putting in some fur. Now I've got a selection of fur brushes. So let's put some long furs into here. Now what I'm going to use, I'm just going to use me light that I've already got. Change the opacity, change the size. And Oops. Let's have a practice here. Try that size. No, just got a little bit. Let's try these hair brushes here. Oh, this is, might be better. I can put these on. That's better. Yes, I like this brush. This is a better brush. So let's just reduce it, increase it. And let's just put in very light hairs. Coming down the ear here, look. That's it. Now I can start to go into the blue here. This is a very strong blue. Where there's a few hairs coming down here, you see. Just picking up the light. So all right, go back to my other brushes. Let's try the long fur. Well, that's quite nice. Let's change it to a white. Yes, I like this. Maybe a few just going up. Oops, it's a bit strong. Change the opacity. You've just got to make the fur work for you. That's better. Join the blue. little bit of blue up here on the top. So I'm going to add a few little strokes. With the same brush but a lot smaller. There we go, see? That's better. Maybe a little bit of blue just down here, look. That's it, we're well, picking up the light, see? Let's go to my violets. Because I can see violets along here. So I'll change the hair. That's it. And there we go. Starting to be a a little bit violet either. Yeah. Okay, I want a little bit more with a white. So let's bring that there's a little bit of darkness there, so I'm gonna go in back with a a soft blend just inside here, look. Just for my darkness. So I want these white bits to stand out. So I'm, I'm putting in some dark just underneath the blue, see? We'll bring it along. Now I want a little bit of chocolate just up here. Going towards the 